Welcome to a demonstration of Motivate, a component of New Voice Media's Contact Well for Sales. I'm a sales rep with Best Tech, a supplier of high-tech equipment to the audio-visual industry. I'm logged into the Salesforce Service Cloud and the Contact Pad from New Voice Media. Before I start work, I'd like to talk about something I do at home, which is playing games, and I play games online. One of the reasons I do that is I love to win. I want to climb up leaderboards and I want to get badges. Motivate is similar because it uses principles of game mechanics to encourage me to carry out the right activities and get the right results for the business. Let me show you to some of the Motivate information that's being presented. This is the Motivate dashboard. If I just pause it for a minute, the first component of this Motivate dashboard is the level. Now we're playing a big cats game. Everybody wants to be a tiger or a lion or a leopard perhaps right now. Well, I'm on level three, a little spotted cat, and I really need to do a little bit better than that. The next tab in the dashboard are the badges that I've owned. It's called the trophy cabinet. And these badges refer to things like the number of calls I'm making, whether I'm actually finding hot leads, for example. And these are the level ups I've achieved, and I've achieved two so far. The third component is the leaderboard. And you can see that I'm third with 43 points. I don't want to be third at all. I'd like to be first, but I don't have much to do to overtake Jason and get to second place. You can also see some key promotions. Now these are short-term incentives that are there to encourage me to carry out maybe some key activities that the business would like us all to do this week, perhaps, or this month. So this particular promotion says, if I have a fabulous call and my manager reviews that call as excellent, then I'm going to get some additional points. So I need to get a move on. So I'm going to actually go down and pick one of the leads that came in today. Now this lead came through our website. And all I have is the name of the person, Margaret Platts. Now she works at Theatre Audio Specialists. I don't know what she does. I don't have any other information about her other than a phone. What I do know is I need to fill in some of the information on this by making a phone call. For example, look at this nudge. I'll get an experience point. Well, that would get me second to Jason by collecting this amount of information on a phone call. So I'm not going to waste any more time. I'm going to call Margaret. My phone's ringing. I'm waiting for Margaret to pick up. Hey, Margaret. It's Harry Smith from Best Tech. Thanks very much for coming to our website. What interests you about Best Tech? And I'm going to have a conversation with Margaret, of course, to find out certain key information. So let's just release that phone call and I can edit the lead and I can fill in the information I obtained. What I actually asked her was for her email address. Now I know that collecting email address, market at theatreaudiospecialist.com, it's really important to get that sort of information. The lead source, well I know it came from the web and I also know through those nudges that capturing the source of the lead is important for me to get points. In fact, I also know that our business needs to understand where we get leads from. The rating, well actually, this lead is pretty hot because she's in the market right now to purchase a large amount of audio equipment for their business. I also asked her what her title was and she said she's the e chief audio engineer. And I'm going to hit save. Now, if you'll notice, even during that call, because I was capturing information, in fact, because I made a call, I accrued some points. I now have 48 points. Some of my badges have gone up. If I go back to the leaderboard, this is really good news. I'm now second. I'm four points ahead of Jason. I need another six points to be top. So I can't wait to carry on. Thanks for watching.